screenshot. There we go. We'll put that back up in my base since I lost the original. I don't know why it does that. Every time I quit the game and reload it, all my screenshots are deleted. I don't know why it does that. Can you guys move? I don't want to. I don't want to hurt you. Excuse me. Sorry. And it's moments like this where I'm just like, damn it. I wish I could play this in VR. <laughs> Maybe that'll be a thing. Maybe we'll play through this entire game all over again once I eventually get an Oculus Rift and we'll do it in VR or HTC Vive, whichever one I end up getting. Man, I wonder if they ever made like concept art of what this creature, this big one here, the the Apex Predator. That'd be a cool name for it, the Apex Leviathan. Ooh, that'd be a cool name. I wonder if there's any concept art out there of what they believed this would have looked like in Flesh and Blood. Because I would love to see that. Oh, frick. It don't like me! Uh-oh. I think it's gonna hit me. Nope, it missed me. Okay. Oh, shit, it's coming back. Shields! I said shields! God damn it, I missed the button! Fuck you! Go away! Are you coming back? God damn it! Go away! Emergency speed. Emergency speed! Go away! Okay, it's leaving me alone. Warning. External hull damage and explosion. I know that. We're okay for now, though, I think. Warning. Vessel calibrated. Excessive I noise. slowed it down. Chill the fuck out. I'm on top of it. I got it. Oh my god! Why is it still here? Ah! No, oh, fuck. Maybe we're not okay. Emergency speed! I think we go this way. Shit. I don't remember the way out of here. Uh, where'd it go? Is it still here? Please tell me it went back. Fuck me. Okay, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Stop it. Thank you. You know, hold on. I don't want to be cavitating when I'm not. I hit slow. Okay, put it back on slow. I gotta get, prepare myself again. Jesus Christ. Where's this third injury? There it is. Knew it was on the table, the tail somewhere. Okay. Good to go. Don't got any suckies to worry about because we're not in that biome anymore. We're okay. Back to it. Now I just gotta find the- okay, it's right there. I know this fossil marks the way out. I turned the right way. <laughs> Good. <laughs> okay, we can go standard. Ahead standard. Oh god! Fine. That was one heck of a journey, but we made it back. We got the Cyclops in and out of the Lava Zone without destroying it. I will say, once the Silent Running update was established and the Cyclops could start taking damage, that's something that I can say I've never done before. Is make it there and back with the Cyclops intact. <laughs> that's not something I was able to do in the early access version of this game. But... I don't think be piloting this beauty again. All right, time to put in the screenshot. Let's put in that one. Upload. Beautiful. It is. Okay, I need two ion power cells, which means I need four of these babies. All right, I've made some ion batteries for the first time. Go ahead and put those away because I don't need them. All right, I needed two ion power cells. One, two, three, four crystalline sulfur. Two, three, four kyanite, my plasteel ingot, and two ion power cells. That's what I need. I got it. Going up. Oh my god, that was an ordeal. <laughs> just to get the kyanite. I had it. It was just in my cyclops down in the frickin' lava zone. If I had the presence of mind to take it with me, we could probably have beat the game by now. <laughs> Fuel reserve. God, it's so huge! Is that it? Is that the last piece I needed? Look at it, it says Neptune on the side. Oh my god. Is that it? Is that the last piece I needed? I mean, I guess I, I need a cockpit, right? 
Yeah, it's definitely not complete. I think I need. I still. I still need to build the cockpit. I do. I've made that. I can just take it out of my Cyclops right now. Hermetically sealed environment with life, life support, and launch controls. Dude, my heart just skipped. I think. I think this is it. I need to make another computer chip. Plasteel ingot. I can make enamel glass, that's not a problem. Cyclops shield generator's not a problem. The only thing that that's a problem is the computer chip. Oh, the sun's going down. Hold on, I'm gonna go up top and see what this looks like right now. I haven't been up top in a while. Huh? Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Huh? yeah. All right, fine. <laughs> As the sun's going down. Oh, I don't want to beat this game. I haven't felt this way about beating a game since Black Flag. Like, I really didn't want to play Black Flag the day that I beat it because I knew I was going to beat it. And I didn't want to. And that was back in 20... It was probably 2014 by the time I beat the story of that game. Maybe? Gosh, I don't know. But, yeah, like... I mean, I can't, right? Let me save this just in case I break something. <laughs> also, after that whole ordeal, I should probably save. Why? Why would I need storage in here? Communications array. Why would I need storage in here? Auxiliary power unit. Hydraulic systems. What is... Uh, okay. Take that. Thank you. I can always make another one. My quartz is in here. Nope. It's in here. Nope. It's in here. There it is. Okay. Glass. Stalker tooth. Which I have plenty of, thankfully. You're welcome for getting that off camera. It was a pain in the butt, let me tell you. Enamel glass. I think that's everything. Computer chip, enamel glass, plasteel ingot, shield generator. Yep, that's it. Oh my god, I'm building the cockpit. Holy crap, is this it? Is this the last piece I need and then I can get out of here? I don't know what's gonna happen, guys. This is far beyond what I knew. I didn't even know there was an escape rocket in the game until I started playing this version. I'm gonna save right here just as the sun is coming up oh this is perfect this is perfect it's way up there bro okay hold on no you know what i'm gonna stay down here in case i need to build something else that looks like that that looks like the nose i think that's it dude i'm cured the gun is disabled. Neptune 1 rocket online. Oh my god. That, like, genuinely scared me. Why did you have to make the music so scary? <laughs> you could have made it, like, you know, a little more victorious sounding. I can name the rocket and color it what I want! <laughs> okay, I'll, uh, I'll name it something. Because, you know, that did cross my mind. Uh... Firebird's child, you requested that the Cyclops be called Poseidon, which is the Greek name for the god of the sea. Uh, the Roman name for the god of the sea is Neptune. So I was like, huh. <laughs> but what are we going to name it? What are we going to name it? Um, oh, I have a good name. I wouldn't have made it this far without the emperor. So that's her name. That's the rocket's name. Okay, now what am I gonna color it? Um, it looks like the white stays. Also looks like the yellow stays. Let's just kind of, oh no it doesn't, oh no it doesn't, okay. <laughs> I like the light blue, okay. Let's, what's this stripe do? Um, oh, there we go, okay. Uh, well, I suppose that can stay white or maybe black. 
Black's cool. Let's, you know what? I'm gonna color this thing like the logo of the game. That's what I'm gonna do. Like the light blue and the orange and stuff. That's fine. And then the name can be... The name can be white. That's fine. I would not have made it this far without the Sea Emperor's help. So our rocket is called the Emperor. Yeah. Okay. I like it. I love it. So... Is this it? Am I beating Subnautica right now? I don't wanna! <laughs> I've waited so long for this! And for, like, I actually beat this game in, like, what is it? Less than a month? When did it come out? December 4th? Yeah, like, I think this is one of the quickest games I've ever beaten on the channel that didn't take, you know, like, one day, you know, to record the whole thing, like a lot of the VR games I've played. I beat this game so fast! <laughs> Too fast! Oh, but I was so excited to play, I just binged it. I could have had this done, like, a month earlier, too, if I hadn't waited between episodes... What was it? Episodes, uh, 19 and, and 21. Like, I could have had this beaten... A lot quicker. Oh, I don't want to. I'm gonna have to- all this stuff! My Poseidon, Abyss Walker, Nereid... I wonder if I went to go visit the Sea Emperor one more time if she'd like actually be dead, but I don't actually want to see that. I don't want to see that, so we're not gonna look. But my base? I put so much love and work into that? We've spent so much time here. Let's see, what's the counter at? It says, oh, that's when I got that log. So it's been at least two or three days since then. So I'm gonna say it's day 115. It's 114, 115 something. That's a long time. <laughs> I don't. I want to. I've waited so long to see what the ending of Subnautica is like. But now that it's here, I don't want to scared me. I don't want to leave. The mountain island is there, in case you're wondering what that is. They cover it with clouds if you're too far off for the draw distance to load it in. That's what they do with islands. I think the floating one is over there. <laughs> See? Yeah. So, oh god, look at it. This is... Ah! I don't want to do it! I'm gonna say it one more time. Oh my god. That ambulance kicked in early. Should I be taking something with me? Hydraulic systems. Pressurizing hydraulics. Well, that, that voice is cool. Power. Auxiliary power unit. Online. Communications. Communications systems array active. Sparkling up there. I can't believe we're about to do this. Oh my. What? Oh, look at this! Oh, this is awesome! Sensor below? Primary CPU. It looks like a laptop. That looks like my laptop right over here. <laughs> oh my god. Primary computer systems active. This has been one hell of a journey, guys. Like, even in the early access version. I've played this game so much and never knew how it ended. Time capsule. Is that how you launch time capsules? It's from other people that have beaten the game. To do that. I could, but I don't want to spoil anything for them. I can leave a 
message? I don't know what to say! Uh, crap, um... Should I leave, like, a helpful tip? Um, should I just say hi? <laughs> like, I don't know what to do! Oh god, I don't have anything to put in there either. I mean, I guess I have whatever I have in my inventory. That's why everyone just puts a set of tools into the time capsule. I've opened two, or three, I think. Two in this save, I think, and then one in my freedom save. And they've all had, like, gold, like, one piece of gold and, like, all of their tools. It's because it's the end of the game. They didn't want to go back down in their base and grab something. I'll give them... I'll give them a nutrient block. I'll give them a first aid kit. Um... An extra battery? Sure. And... Just in case they haven't found their what they haven't made their water filtration system yet, I'll give them that. If I still had it, <laughs> I would put in the image that I captured of the Reaper Leviathan as it ate me. <laughs> if I still had it, that's what I'd put in. Climb on back down. Out here. I'll take a picture of the Aurora, just out here. Um, I don't really want to give away the thing, so I don't really want the railing in, in view. There we go, perfect. Right. Nope, right. Fuck, right. There. Perfect. Okay, that'll do. Enjoy the game. Uh, wh where's the brackets? Here they are. There it is. Good luck. Don't die. Enjoy the game. Heart. <laughs> That's my message. Okay, so I can launch it now. I don't know how. Time capsule ready. Okay, it's ready. How do I launch it? Launch. 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 Do something! Okay, let's activate life support. Life support systems what? online. And I just miraculously know how all that works. Okay, you know what? All systems are go. For lift off. So I can just launch rocket exclamation point. So when I take off, will the time capsule launch? Okay. Yeah, this, I, I guess I'm just gonna launch. Guys, guys, guys! I'm gonna save. I'm gonna save right here. I'm gonna save right here. I can't believe this is actually happening right now. I have waited so long to see how Subnautica ends. And we're about to see it together. You guys ready? In three, two, one. Leave only time capsules? Ready to launch on your command, Captain. Launch in ten. What? Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, two, one. <laughs> oh my god. Oh there it goes! Captain Jettison. Okay, good. Approaching orbital debris field. Oh no! No. Are we good? Orbital debris field clear. Performing gravity turns. Are we gonna get a look at it? Oh my god, look at it! Look! Confirm destination coordinates. Nearest interstellar phase gate. Engaging ion boosters in three, two, one.
What is a wave without the ocean? A beginning without an end? They are different, but they go together. Now you go among the stars, and I fall among the sand. We are different, but we go together. That's right. Bye-bye, Sea Emperor. I named my escape rocket after you. She's right. We go together. Goodbye, Sea Emperor. Goodbye, base. Oh my god! <laughs> Goodbye, Planet 4546B! We did it! <laughs> Holy crap! I wasn't expecting to hear from her again at the end. Wow, Unknown Worlds is a lot bigger than I thought. This is the music that plays when your Cyclops is on fire. <laughs> oh look, they have the voice actors here too now. Really? Simon Chalinski was the player as well. He's the one that did the soundtrack and the sound editing. Um, and there's the huge like controversy surrounding him. I didn't know he voiced the main character. That's interesting. Wow. I wonder if they'll have, like, thanks to Jacksepticeye and, like, Markiplier in here somewhere. My hands are tingling. I clap too hard. <laughs> oh my fucking god. I cannot believe we finally saw the end to Subnautica. I have been waiting for that for so long, guys. So long. You have no idea. Valve and Unity. There, look at Jacksepticeye and Markiplier. 8-Bit Ryan is in there, too. Oh, look at, look at. That's so cool. YouTube and Twitch streamers everywhere, Subnautica wiki community, hundreds of dedicated online translators, our families and friends, our fans. Without you, Subnautica would not have been possible. Families of Newtown, Welcome Connecticut. Welcome to all Terra. Permission to land will be granted once you have settled your outstanding balance of one trillion credits. Oh, go fuck yourself. How about you go fuck yourself? No way I'm paying that. No way. Oh no, and that's it. One trillion. Get out of here. <laughs> okay, so I can load it back up. Oh, just hearing that music after seeing how it ends. We go together. Oh, that was so nice. That was so nice! Oh my god, we saw the end of Subnautica! I'm still not over that. Oh, this is something so special. This is something that I have been looking forward to doing for you for over a year. I think it's probably even close to two years, if not over two years, because while I was still playing it, I'm like, I can't wait to play version 1.0 on YouTube for the people! <laughs> But it's not over. We still have the Below Zero expansion, which is already in early access by the time you guys see this. And I still haven't made up my mind if I'm gonna go on PC and do that. I think it's gonna suck waiting however long to play this game again. But I think that's how I wanna do this. I'm gonna stay away from early access, away from videos of early access, and I'm gonna jump in completely blind when the expansion hits version 1.0 on PS4 again. Unknown Worlds, I don't know if you're gonna make another game after this, but God do I hope you do, and I hope it's like this. Just like, charming, horrifying survival on an unknown planet, on an unknown world. Oh, I'm not ready to say goodbye. The other thing that we're gonna do besides the expansion DLC, uh, like DLC, is it gonna be a DLC or is it gonna be a separate expansion? I know nothing about Below Zero. But another thing that we're gonna do once I catch up on my freedom save uh, is we're gonna 
disable the the gun. We're gonna disable the gun. Uh, you know, cure ourselves, do the whole thing with the Sea Emperor again. And then I'm gonna do all of that before the sunbeam enters the atmosphere of 4546B. And I'm gonna see what happens. Because if the gun isn't there to shoot it down when it lands, I wanna see what happens. I wanna see what happens. So that's what we're gonna do. The other thing that we're gonna do is I'm gonna take my prawn suit to the edge of the crater and I'm gonna jump down and see what's at the bottom. I don't expect to get back out, but well, I, I wanna see what's down there. Oh, it feels so good, but it feels so bad at the same time that it's over. To see this game in, in, in a complete form was mind boggling. I'm, I was not expecting us to be able to play it on PlayStation, but they did it. With the help of Panic Button, they did it. And boy, did they hit the ball out of the park. 10 out of 10, fuck it. 11 out of 10, 20 out of 10. I love this game so much. And I hope you guys do too. I hope you guys enjoyed this series as much as I enjoyed making it for you. This was something I've been looking forward to doing for so long and I'm so sad it's over, but I'm so happy we were able to do it together. I have a lot, I have over 1400 videos on this channel. So if you're a newcomer, you've got plenty of content to keep you busy <laughs> until, uh, until Below Zero is launched. But until then, um, all we can do is, is wait. I hope somebody finds my time capsule. That'd be kind of cool. Anyway, I've been stalling and it's, it's time to say goodbye to Subnautica for a second time, but hopefully it won't be as long of a wait until we can hop into the Below Zero expansion 1.0 on PlayStation. So leave a like and favorite if you guys enjoyed, subscribe if you want to see more, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Farewell, friends.